and this math class. In today's tutorial, we are going to be looking at why theory questions. Yeah, in this tutorial, we are going to give you questions that are likely to go to come out in this year exam. So if a candidate who is preparing for the 23 week exam, I will ask you to kindly watch book this uh, YouTube channel because why we are going to be uh, giving out questions that you are going to see for your objective and your theory. Okay, make sure you watch and subscribe. Now let's go to the board to solve these questions. Is what a trigonometric ratio. So since the is a trigonometric ratio, given that sign x equals to two over three, evaluate leaving your answer in solved form. So your answer should be in what in solved form, without using table or calculator. Find tan x minus cos x. So for me to solve this first, I must represent this with what an angle. So I will use my angle to what illustrate this question. Given that sign x equals to two over three, being that my sign x sin x equals to in fact what i'm going to do okay make sure we work with this so that this will guide you this will guide you to solve it without no mistake okay this is what we use to solve this or uh, question of uh, question when you sit in the exam so what is sign x what is sign our sign theta our sign equals to what opposite of our what hypotenuse opposite over hypotenuse so this is our sign so all the opposite now is what two over and what is our hypotenuse is what is three so i'll now use my word uh, angle to represent this so i will do my right angle triangle yeah okay so since i have my triangle here what happened i will name it by giving by saying here is my c Capital C, capital A, and capital B. So here's my C, here's my A, and my angle ABC. So in my angle ABC, okay, can I see that where is our hypotenuse and where is our opposite? You can see that here's our hypotenuse and it's what? 3. And here's our what? Opposite, which is what two, so I'm fine here. So let me say yes, yes, should be B. Let me that B, okay? So the next thing to do now is to what apply what they call what using, okay? Let's go to let's let's yes, okay? Applying what apply Pythagoras theory, Pythagoras theory. We see that c square equals to a square plus what b square. So back to our diagram again. B, so here's our what small letter what c. Here's our what small letter what a, and here's our what small letter b. So don't be confused, okay? Because this c is facing this place. This capital letter c is facing this direction. Our capital letter a is facing what this direction. And our B is in direction. So anyway, so we just our C square. So let's go back to C square. Our C square is what? If you see, do one like this. It's what three square. Because so what's our A square? Our A square is what two square. And our B is not given is unknown. So our B is unknown. So B square. Meaning that three square. We can say B square. Equals to three square minus two square. What I did was correct like times there. So b square or b square equals to three x two is what is nine minus four. So b square equals to nine minus four is what five. So what happened for me to what I made this out this square square of both sides. This square of both sides. This square root of both sides. So cancel this square. This square root of both sides. Because why? I want can this square. So b square cancel this square equals to square root of five. 
So square cancel square. We have what square root cancel square is what b equal to sword five. Okay. Now I will leave my answer like this because why right, the instruction says we should leave our answer in sword form. So my answer will be in what sword five. I want to say square root of five. Or this sword five, which is my answer. Now back to what we have here. The next thing is we find tan tan x. So we can say that tan x, our tan is what? Tan is equal to what? Based on what they say, that tan is equal to what? Opposite over adjacent. So we have opposite here as what? 2. We have opposite as what? 2, two is what? Opposite. So 2 over. And what is our. Um, okay, sorry for that. Okay. So let me use. Let me uh, describe it very well for us. Let me read that again. Tan is what? Opposite. Over what adjacent is our term. So equals to what's our opposite here is what two. Two is our opposite. So here's my two over adjacent is what is your new answer. We got as what sort five, which is B. B is what? B is sort five. So sort five. Okay. So this um answer here now. Is in what is in sort form is right is, is a rational rationalized word sort since is a word rationalized sort what happened and it's where it involved division what happened i will rationalize this sort by saying that this denominator multiply the numerator and the denominator what am i that i'll say here two over sort five right so it says that whenever you have solving sort that involve a denominator a, 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 a denominator that, that, that is and the numerator is what is rationalizable. What happened? I will use the numerator the denominator to multiply the numerator and the denominator, which means that 2 over sod 5 multiply sod 5 over sod 5. And this is the part that many students fail. Yes, many students will just leave it like this and go die to the what the course without rationalizing this sod because this is sod form. So what happened? We say two times sort five is what two sort five over five times sort five times sort five is what sort twenty five, which and this twenty five is a what is a perfect number, which means that two sort five over the square root of twenty five is what is five. So this is now my what my tan. So therefore, therefore my tan is equals to what. 2 sword 5 over 5. I know this. This is not my turn. This is not my word. My turn. Okay? So let's go to the next one. Okay. Then our course, our course is what? Course is what? Back to our Back to our Our course is what? Adjacent over hypotenuse I just sent over hypotenuse and okay before then our sign was what our sign was what opposite of hypotenuse and we have what as our opposite we have what as our opposite we, our sign is our sign was two over three that's our sign right then our course will be so our course is what adjacent over hypotenuse and our adjacent is what sort Five. Don't forget, okay. So at five is our other sense over our hypotenuse. Our hypotenuse is what is three. Okay. So. So now we have gotten our tan. We have gotten our sign, and we have gotten our what? Cos. Okay. Let me. Let me this box to make I'll show that this is what we are looking at. We have gotten our term as what two sort five over five. Our course as what sort five over three. Sort five over three, and our sign is what two over three. Now the question says what? The question they ask us is that we should find oh uh, tan x, tan x minus cos x. This is our question. So our term is given now, and our course is given. Okay, let me clean the board. Okay. Our tan x in this place is what two sort 
5 over 5 minus our cos s is what? So 5 over 3. So this is our tan, based on what you have here, is it tan, is it based on what you have here, is it tan x minus cos x? So in this place now we have it as what? 5, 2 so 5 over 5 minus 5 over 3. So what happened? We find the s of 5 and 3. We find the LCM of 5 and 3. The s of 5 and, 5 and 3 is what? 15. 15 is the LCM of 5 and 3. Being that 5 goes into 15. How many times? 3 times. 3 times 2. Okay, 3 times. Okay. 2 so 5 for better understanding. Minus 3 going to 15. How many times? 5 times sword 5 equals 2. So 3 times 2 is what 6 sword 5. Don't multiply the or uh, or sword or the number inside the sword because why this is not it's not a sword. So 3 times 2 is what 6 minus 5 sword 5 all over what 15. Which means that 6 sword 5 minus 5 sword 5 is what 1. So, is what 1 sort 5. So, you can see sort 5 over 15 is our word final answer. So, 5 over the final answer. So, these are what final answer. Just can you what, watch the tutorial carefully so that you can understand one or two things there. Okay? Okay, so this question we solve here, okay, are questions which I like it to come out and believe me that that number one we solve <laughs> that number one we solve if you're a candidate that is writing work right this year 2023 work for that question number one it is the most that you see it and if you do that after the exam come back to this channel and tell us if it's true or not okay so if this is the first time of watching our tutorial or learning something from me please i would like you to watch subscribe like Drop a comment, share to your friends, to your classmates, and also keep coming back to watch our tutorial. Thank you very much. See you in our next class. Bye bye for now.